There was heavy police presence on the road this morning in Leh as people prepared to hear the response from the provincial government. Just seven days ago, these were the scenes in Leh as more than 3,000 people gathered at Sir Ignatius Kilagi Stadium to present the list of demands to the provincial government. This morning, a more orderly crowd. Morbi Governor Kelly Naru went through the list of demands, spending time to address each one. Of prime concern for Lay City are street vendors who get their supplies from Asian-owned shops. The vendors congregate in public spaces like Eriku and in many reported cases have been responsible for harassment and petty crimes. Last week, the provincial government announced a ban on street vendors. Today, the government said there will be an additional 40 people placed in key locations to assist in providing security. We've got a manpower of 20. We will beef up another 40. And uh, they will come from uh, this place and all these other areas. Two million kina has been allocated for the exercise. Much of it is coming from Morbe's internal revenue collections. Total budget is about two million. But uh, because we have to roll it out immediately, we look for funds somewhere and then we roll it out. But unfortunately, uh, the bigger component, as uh, we all know, Inokam, PSIP, I'm now Nogadogada. Street vendors may have come to the fore, but it's the land shortages and the lack of economic opportunities that's troubling the province. More beings feel marginalized, left out in the economic development that's happening around them. Scott Wyde, National MTV News, Leigh.